which is the plush and Sherpa sleeping bag. So it's 75 by 26 inches, also safe for this show, also a brand new price. It's $20 off at $29.95. And a sleeping bag, you cannot underestimate how uh, the importance of having a sleeping bag handy. I'll go through the colors. This is the Buffalo Check. The one next to it is a plaid. It's called, I believe, tartan plaid. Blue-green tartan plaid. And then we have it in the navy blue. And then camo, how fun is that? Then down front, I've got the snow leopard with a pink snow leopard in there, really pretty. Soft snow leopard. Next to it is purple. And then I have blush. And then the last one I have is the leopard. and. You know, I I know that when my daughter was little, you know, the sleepover, you know, bring your sleeping bag kind of a thing. But there's so many other reasons to, to, to have a sleeping bag. You know, you've got company coming and you're like, okay, I have room for the, the grownups, but now I've got three teenagers I have to uh, fit somewhere. A sleeping bag can really just be on top of any anything, a couch or anything, and, and, and it becomes your spare bedroom. <laughs> right, Ellen? Totally. And this one's really convenient because it has a built-in strap. Um, it's self-contained, so there's no bag to put it in. It even has the pillow built in. So I actually have this one. I wanted to open it up. It has the hook and loop closure on your strap. So when you unhook this, um, you can just roll this out. And the beauty in this is it's so plush between the micro plush on one side and the faux Sherpa on the other that you can actually open this up. <laughs> Snickers <laughs> is awake now. <laughs> is That's awake. the update. It unzips, <laughs> unzips all the way around, and then your pillow is actually built right into the end. So you don't even have to have an extra pillow, which makes it really convenient. So think about even if you want to throw this on a sofa, on a on a air mattress, instead of having to dress the entire thing with linens, or even on the floor. And with this unzip. It actually folds out to an entire um, <laughs> faux sherpa on one side. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, there he is. And plush on the <laughs> other. Yeah. <laughs> but this one has been really popular every year that we brought it in. It's kind of an upgrade to the basic sleeping bags that are out there that are like plasticky and not very comfortable. This is a really thick pile, very nice and plush. You can machine wash it. And I like it because, you know, Helen, did you ever have to take your daughter's sleeping bag and try to fit it back into the bag that it came in? Yes, I know what you're talking about. Never... Impossible. Impossible. By the way, Impossible. I do think it's also a great idea to leave one in your car. I grew up in upstate New York, and with weather and everything, I always always had a blanket in my car. This kind of sleeping mm -hmm. bag would be amazing. I know there was, like, this awful situation on I-95 the other day. I saw it on the news. Those poor people were like stuck yes. on the fr for 36. And I thought, oh gosh, I hope they have blankets in their cars. I'm always saying blankets in your cars. I know somebody Me opened too. up the back of a truck that had bread in it that fed people on the road. I thought that was like a beautiful story of people taking care of each other. I think that it, in this snowy weather of like, you don't know what, what's coming next. It's nice to have one of these in your car as well. And think about camping and camping can be in the backyard, right? Camping can right. be, it doesn't have to be like, I know, so, like, can we travel? We can, we can't, we can, we can't. You know, it can be, I, I remember doing that with my daughter, like, okay, we're gonna do a tent in the living room and this would be like your fun sleeping bag and you do a little pillow for it. it it's just like a really great thing, you know, and whether you have kids or not, sometimes um, if you're, you know, getting over something. My dad actually recently had surgery and he's, you know, rehabilitating from something and can't walk up the stairs. So a, a little sleeping bag, like on the chair down at the downstairs level would be like a really comfy way to be wrapped up and zipped up and feel really cozy and comfortable wherever you are. The sleeping bag has a lot of uses in a family and you'll be glad you got one, especially at $29.95. So I love it. And also don't forget about the pink or the snow leopard for Valentine's Day. It's only five weeks away. So. So there's my suggestion for you. All right, Ellen, thank you so much. And tell Snickers you did, thank as you, always, Helen. a wonderful job. I know he's expensive to have oh. added to the show, but. <laughs> well, yes, yes. Only by your request, you <laughs> Snickers would always show up for you, Helen. <laughs> thank, thank you, Snickers. I, I appreciate it. I'll, I'll call Snickers' his agent and thank him, you know, for allowing Snickers to appear. Now, coming up in about 20 minutes, um, 